you doing with my dog? Nothing. Right? Don't tell her anything. <clears throat> you look guilty. <clears throat> Angel. You look guilty. Oh, play cute. Play cute. Is that it? Works every time. <sighs> morning. 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 <laughs> Even though it's afternoon. I said morning. And then she said, Achoo! Achoo! Never mind. Even though it's afternoon. Okay. What are you doing? I have been told to work on the intro. So that is what I am doing. You can't work on the garage door. Can't um, work on the garage door. Can't work on the on the the shelves that fell. Yeah, I didn't even hear it. I did, but I thought it was from upstairs. I thought. What time was it? Up. Around three in the morning. Mm. Yeah. I overloaded those shelves. They weren't designed for heavy stuff. But, and I kind of thought it might happen. Then. Kaboom. Kaboom. Well, well, well. Here we are. I am running off to uh, get some medication for Val. We keep forgetting to go get it, so I gotta get it now. And uh, I'm gonna go to Home Depot. The um, shelves that I have in the garage that I was stacking paint on collapsed last night and uh, so yes there's more paint on the ground luckily again it didn't go on to anything that I couldn't get paint off of and I just have to do the same thing I have to uh, wait for it to dry and then just peel it up but uh, meanwhile we have to walk around it and today I want to put some new shelves up so far more sturdier than than I had. The problem, of course, is with all the uh, paint work that I've been doing, I've been collecting more paint, and uh, I just overloaded the the, sh the shelves, and they were not really designed to carry that kind of thing. So that's what I'm doing. Val is continuing her marathon, and um, so she's uh, at home relaxing. I still don't have time to get to the garage door. I think I'm going to need help doing it because it is 16 feet long. I don't think I can take those uh, sections apart by myself. I'm going to need another pair of hands. And since we can't open the garage, we have to stack them on the inside of the garage. And that means creating more space in the garage. So, yep. Oh, I called um, a um, bankruptcy lawyer today. Was, uh, came highly recommended from my friend Dave and um, I don't think it's looking real good for me um, he said my house is worth too much money federal uh, federal laws allow to write off about a hundred thousand uh, dollars of equity in your house my house may be worth more than that so um, and I have this truck that I actually own. I'm not making payments on it. It says if I declare, if uh, Chapter 7 bankruptcy protection, uh, I could be forced to sell everything. Not just forced to sell everything, they'll take it from me and sell it. And they will give me whatever's left over after everybody's dipped their hands in it, which could be nothing. Just, this is what I figured it's probably end up being. So I'm not quite sure where I'm going to go with this. So, not sure. So, looking at that, I have an inter I have a, an appointment with him to sit down with uh, the documents and see if it's something I wish to proceed with. Um, otherwise, I'm I will probably just continue the uh, the sale of this truck, and uh, I'm going to have to pay down my bills from the sale of this truck. Let's see what I can go from there. All right, so this is the mess I've made in the garage. We had one can that spilled quite a bit. I don't know which one it is. And I've got a little spill over here and a couple of spots over here. And I've uh, kind of 
cut, uh, well, I didn't cover it, but I put cans next to everything so nobody accidentally steps in it. This was one of the shelves is still up, as you can see. Um, these were not designed to hold this much weight. These are basically uh, in interior closet shelves. That I think they can only hold 30, 40 pounds. And I'm putting about 100 pounds on there. So i got to replace that. I've priced it out. It's going to cost me about $50, which I don't have right now. So I'm just going to let it sit here. Garage is still not working. I still have ways for stray cats to get in, which is not good. And uh, that's the way it looks right now in here. So what are you coloring right now? I'm coloring cards to mail out to people. But I got to do two of my favorite things today. What's that? Color and watch Daryl Dixon. Uh-huh. Mm-hmm. And I stayed away from the garage today so I didn't get to feed the cat. <laughs> Jay came in and talked about the cat, but I didn't go out and feed the cat. Uh-huh. Good. So, I All was right. a good girl today. Well, good, for a change. <laughs> Always a good girl. Okay. In my own mind. <laughs> well. Mm-hmm. Val's real tired and she's been killing zombies all day. <laughs> mm hmm. Anyway, I've been coloring. See, I even have a colored pencil in my hand right now. <laughs> anyway, guys, I hope you enjoyed what you saw. And if you did, please give us a great big thumbs up. A like, a share, a comment. A sh uh, I think I said a share already, didn't I? All that happy, crappy stuff. And we. See my beard light up? I think we should put some sparkles in it. Some glitter in it for Christmas. For Halloween, some some orange and, and black glitter. Mm hmm Okay, see you later. Bye. <laughs> see you guys tomorrow. Bye.